So let me guess, you're a marketer and you're having trouble coming up with content. Just can't think of any content to put out there for value, to share, to help your followers, your subscribers, your people on your email list. Hey, guess what? I've got a great, great solution for you. This is amazing. It's a website and I want to show it to you now. Hey, my name's Lamar Scholl. I'm from LamarScholl.com. Go check my website out. I love it. It's on this new platform called eStage and it doesn't run on WordPress or anything like that. It is so super duper easy to use. You don't even have to understand how to host a website. It's great if you're a non-techie and you want to make stunning looking websites. All right, but that's not what this video is about. I just got sidetracked here a little bit. But what I want to talk about is you're probably struggling, right? Trying to come up with content. Like, what do I talk about on my lives or in a video or those dreaded emails, right? How do I offer value? I don't even know what. Well, the first thing and the most important thing you want to know or when you do this it's like you have to think, well, what do other people, what questions like your followers or your subscribers, your people on your email list, what kind of struggles or questions do they have? So this is, you have to really know your audience better. But I get it. Let's say you don't, right? Because I remember this is where I first started. But I still wanted to know, right, what questions to ask and first. I didn't just want to think of guessing because usually me when I guess it's totally completely wrong if I guess something and if I do the opposite then I'm usually right but I don't want you to do it that way either I've got this website that I found well somebody actually showed it to me so in a way I sort of kind of sort of found it because then I found them which yeah never mind. but anyways this is pretty cool because because you can type anything into this website and it's going to come back with so many answers and I like it too because it graphically shows these questions and this will make more sense in a second here when I show you the website but it will lay out the information for you so that you see like the importance what people are asking and all this there's a paid but there's also you know a paid version of this website or you know you can get in but it's also you can use it for free as well and the information there I believe is going to be definitely enough to help you so let me just take you over my screen right now and stop delaying and yakking on here all right so this is the website here it's called answer the public so just go to answer the public.com now when you come down to the website here you could type in whatever you want like any question about like how do I get more sales or you know like how do I what is affiliate marketing or you know what is the best MLM um, system out there whatever you want right like what's the best gold coin or what gold coin should I collect to help me reduce taxes if you like say you live in the US but again I'm getting sidetracked so I gotta pull myself back in now the next thing you want to do is make sure you just select the country you know where you're from down here right because the questions are gonna be more pertinent to you know like focus in that way and also the language so you just can click here and then click over here to change the country and then what you want to do is just put your question in right here so I put in affiliate marketing right so what I'm gonna do and then just hit your search button and then you're gonna come back to a screen that looks just like this one now so you can see I typed in affiliate marketing I've got 76 questions right so don't worry I this kind of looks kind of funky how it's in this circle pattern I kind of like it but if you see how it's broken down here I'm just gonna break some of this down I'm gonna show you a different view as well so you can look at this thing and you can see that we have groups here and they're grouped by like how you know will which can what where right why all this stuff are so these are broken down in these sections you notice these green circles here the darker circle is like the more important one you should focus on and work your way down this way but 
as you read around this circle here, I almost said circle of fifths, I was thinking of music, but as you read around this circle here, you will see like they got all these questions and don't worry if you can't see it right now in the monitor i'm gonna i'm gonna help you here in a second but i just want to show you the layout so they got questions and then they you come down here still pertaining to affiliate marketing they got prepositions and it's laid out in the same way same old-fashioned right and oh yeah okay comparisons right so we've got comparisons down here as well so this layout's pretty cool. Then they've got also these alphabetical, you can go down here through topics. But let me go back up to the top. If this is kind of a little too much to kind of get your brain around, there's one thing, you know, because it is kind of hard to look, bending your neck and everything. If you look over here, whoops, over here at the top of the website, you can download a CSV file, okay? So what it's gonna do is take all this information in these, or, you know, this order, and put it in a text file for you. And I still got another option after this. So I'm just gonna find, I'm gonna find, I don't see it here. Um, let me, sorry about that. Let me go over here. I'm over in my other monitor. I'm gonna, I thought I had a, I downloaded the CSV file earlier. So I am gonna open that up right now. I'm gonna show you what that looks like here. I'm just gonna drag it over. Here we go. Now, so this is the file here. So you remember my keyword was affiliate marketing. So all this is gonna be affiliate marketing here. So let me here, I can just blow this up a little bit and then we'll get into the details now a little bit here, right? So this is the questions area, right? So let me just slide that over. So you remember we're up here in affiliate marketing, 76 questions. So here's questions right here. So you can see we have a R modifier, right? So questions are, I'm gonna show you where this is on that circle. Are affiliate marketing courses really worth it? Think about people asking this question. And if you're selling or promoting an, an affiliate marketing course, wouldn't that be a cool thing to answer? To answer this question? right so if you can answer this question somebody's either watching your video or reading your email and you're selling this affiliate marketing course see how all this lines up but check this out right so this is in the r section then we got can right but let's go over to our circle and here's r if you look at the dark green one if i blow i can just zoom out on this and let me uh, let me come down, I'm just having a little tough time. But you can see right here, the dark green, our affiliate marketing course is really worth it, right? So boom, you got the dark green right there, right? And if we go to the other one, what were we at? We're and or something, but look at how, let's see. Our, you know, how affiliate marketing works, right? That sounds like it's a pretty good top question. So let's go find the how section right here, the top one right here how affiliate marketing works so you can see when you import that csv file into excel or any spreadsheet program this starts to make sense so i'm just saying you can use the csv file if the circle kind of drives you a little bit nuts let me just zoom back out here for one second okay so the other thing you can do, we can look at the data on the website in two different ways, right? So we got visualization and we got data. Before I switch over to data, you can download this image, by the way, which I would do so you can keep referring back to later, right? So you can just hit download image and it'll bring you up to this screen and then you can just right click and you can just hit save image and boom, it's on your drive and you can use that at any time, right? So let me just back out of here. So we're back to the website, right? So download image. Now, if you wanna look at it in data form, so this to me is a little bit cleaner on the website. So this, remember this section here, R. So if you look at the list, it's in the order of importance, right? So the first one is, are affiliate marketing courses really worth it, right? And the other section we looked at, remember how, how affiliate marketing works. So this to me, is a lot cleaner to look at right so we just went into this data view and what i do now that i kind of 
got familiar with this website, you can start getting ideas by reading this, right? Think about if you have your email subscribers, you're selling an affiliate marketing course, right? Look at these questions, you know, are, now some of this probably doesn't make sense, right? Or complete, right? Say are affiliate marketing. Well, you, you might want to do something. Well, this will give you some ideas, right? You could start looking on Google, right? Say are affiliate marketing. Like I would just come into Google like this. And you can kind of see, look, are affiliate marketing worth it, profitable, legit? See how you're coming up with ideas. And now I'm also taking this as like I'm on Google doing this search because of these word phrases that come up. This is what people are typing in, right? So again, you can use these for ideas. Why are we doing this? Well, this is what people are searching for. And because people are searching for this, if you have affiliate marketers on your following or in your list, guess what? They're probably searching for the same thing as well. So this is a good, you know, a great way to start, right? So let's go back. Let me just close this tab. So for me, I kind of like this data view here so you can see like these sections are broken down so here's can how where when what i mean look at all the ideas right will now you here's you know our other section here our prepositions again we can go to data view and you can look at each of these right and i'm, I'm just kind of going through this fast here but here's comparisons again so if you don't like the visual you can just put it right in data view but I think, look at the ideas here that you get. Now these aren't, I don't know like how this down here, I'm looking at alphabetically, right? Like you can spend some time down here too to get some ideas. But I like, people are always asking questions. People are always comparing things like affiliate marketing to drop shipping, affiliate marketing to whatever, right? Um, so that this is a place that I always use to get quite you know just to start my emails out so the reason why I did this video this morning is because I'm sitting down and saying oh, I want to write an email to my list I have an affiliate marketing list and I thought this was pretty cool right so I came up here and I'm like are affiliate marketing courses worth it so this is like it's not gonna help me fill out my content but the idea like now I'm already halfway there that's how I look at it you know because sometimes just coming up with that idea it's tough to do so next time you want to come up with an idea just go to the free site website called answer the public and just type your question in there and just kind of spend some time on the website like I showed you there's so I can use the same, I can come back here tomorrow, I can use about you know, 20, 30 emails I can probably get out of here alone. I can get some videos done, I can do some Facebook Lives. So if, you're, if you are answering these questions, you're definitely gonna be probably serving your following an email list well. Hey, my name's Lamar Scholl. If you got some value out of this video, subscribe to my channel by just clicking on that button down below smash on that subscribe button and if you really got some value hit that like button you know what just hit that like button anyways drop me a comment let me know what you think what topics did you use this website for all right hey again lamar Scholl out i'll see you on the next one